Aloha and good morning everyone. I hope you guys are excited for another vlog style video because we are going diving again. It's a little bit later in the day than we normally get. Well, later in the day is a relative term. It's only eight o'clock in the morning, but uh, typically if you're a diver, you know that usually the earlier you go out, the better. So we slept in a little bit this morning, but that's okay. We're gonna be going to a dive site off of Alua. There's a gecko crawling on the wall behind you guys. <laughs> Anyway, Ulua Beach and the dive site just off of Ulua Beach are located in South Maui. They're just out from the resorts on the south side. So you got the Andaz, the Fairmont, Grand Wailea, they all kind of create this strip along the beach line or the coastline of South Maui. Um, and it's directly out from what's known as Turtle Town. So if any of you guys have ever heard of Turtle Town or if you've snorkeled Turtle Town while visiting here on vacation, Turtle Town is a bit of a misnomer. It actually means like the whole area because there's turtles all up and down that coastline. There are lots of little individual dive sites in what is greater known as Turtle Town. Turtles don't typically like to hang out in this area, however, on either side of the coastline, just up the shore a little bit, there are reefs that are known to be cleaning stations for turtles. Uh, just to kind of a general idea of what a cleaning station is, because some of you guys might not actually know what that means. Cleaning stations are actually uh, a natural term, meaning that the turtles will go to a specific area of reef because there are fish in that area, like a Hawaiian cleaner wrasse or uh, different types of surgeon fish that will actually hang out in that area and set up a cleaning station or like a little territory. The uh, turtles can swim in and the fish will actually pick off all of the algae and parasites and dead skin off of those turtles. So it's essentially like they're getting a nice cleaning it's like a turtle spa day um, but there's not actually a known cleaning station in Ulua but they do travel up and over that reef in order to get to the cleaning stations on either side so fingers crossed hopefully we see a turtle or two today it's also a really great spot for eels uh, so like there's lots of little nooks and crannies in the reef for the eels to tuck in and hide this reef is also really well known for having really interesting animals that you don't typically see in some other areas so lots of uh, opportunities for frogfish which look super derpy I hope we find one for you guys. It's also known as a really good place for leaf scorpion fish and lionfish, which are both um, a venomous species that we have out here. They're super tiny here in the Pacific, unlike the Atlantic where they're an invasive species and they can grow really large. But the leaf scorpion fish are really fun because they just kind of waft in the waves or waft in the current. Fingers crossed, hopefully we find some cool things today and uh, we'll take you along. See you there.
All right, guys, we just got back from our dive. It was amazing. I'm gonna review the footage from the GoPro when I get home. We just packed up all of the scuba gear in the back. We rinsed them off at the wash station up at the Alua Beach Park area. Really, really fabulous dive, like I said. Lots of eels. We had quite a few nudibranchs. This is nudibranch under the water for those scuba divers out there. Uh, we had some scorpion fish and some frog fish, like I had mentioned. So uh, definitely met all of the expectations for today. All right, guys, well, we're gonna go enjoy our lunch on the beach. We packed a picnic for after our dive. We're gonna go hang out in our Tommy Bahama chairs and enjoy a little bit of sunshine and warm up before we head back to the house.